Are you rooming here with me? Me? Yeah. No. No. Actually, I'm in the south wing. Ta-da! The south wing. That's where they keep the dangerous ones. Are you dangerous? No. Yes! No. Don't listen to him. Actually, my father thought I was very dangerous. <laughs> Your father? Yes. Did he put you here? <laughs> no. Kinda. I strangled him. You mean like that? Oh, no, more like that. I guess he was right about me being dangerous. <laughs> yeah, a lot of doctors have different theories about why I did it. Mother complex, father complex, feelings of inferiority, suppressed rage. But I, and I alone, know the reason that I did it. It was because he was so Polish. Polish? When I was a kid, I was tormented with Polish jokes. Oh, you know. Who was Poland's man of the year? Nobody. How do you sing the Polish national anthem? You don't sing it. You fought it. How do you do Pollock's identification by the shit in his wallet? <laughs> kids can be very cruel. What kids? My father told me those. He was always teasing me. He was a big, loud, hairy, sweaty Pollock! He was covered with sweat, always. The only man that I know who could sweat while he was swimming. And I could never have friends over because he challenged them to a nose-picking contest and he always won. Got a minute? Sure. The last straw came when I finally brought home my girl. You know, before I took her out to dinner, I knew I shouldn't have done it. I shouldn't have done it. Yeah, when we got there, he was just sitting down in his favorite sweaty undershirt, drinking beer, eating chili with his fingers and watching celebrity bowling. At first he was nice, you know. We were talking nice. And then oh, he was so stupid. He said how he thought that Moby Dick was a venereal disease. I told him in a nice way what a stupid idiot he was. And then he told her that he thought that she was wasting her time with a, with a loser like me. So I put my hands around his 22 inch neck and I strangled him. <laughs> we never went out to dinner, needless to say, because I strangled him. <laughs> You say it like you're proud. Well, you didn't have the courage to do it. Stop it. No. Oh. I feel sick. I feel sick. When I was a little kid, my mother left us. She just left us. I was a baby. She said, bye, bye. I have always respected her for that. <laughs> Do you think this country will ever switch to the metric system?